you make it a hype it's not going to work because in our country bans don't really work or something that's what the delhi government should be asking before going cold turkey on smoking from next month the new legislation aims to protect passive smokers but it seems to target mainly educated city dwellers for most residents here the concept of passive smoking itself is alien wo to che to main sab ji kharab ho gayi hogi ab ye baat hai na ye ab kya kare insaan ko jo cheez lag jati hai shuru se wo nahi ho usko bahut mushkil hai insaan ko chhodna mere lag raha hai ki apni sehat to kharab kar rahe hain aas paas ke logon ki bhi sehat kharab kar rahe hain haan ji wo dekhiye baaki wo dusre to kuch bhi karte rahe hain hamare ko dusre se kya lena dena Also the new law allows smoking only at hotels, 30 seater restaurants and airports, not regular hangouts for the less privileged. Some of those who do have the access to these enclaves find the ban intrusive. Something which is again specific to an individual's choice. Someone who wants to smoke would not really care about what are the health restrictions or what are the uh, you can say uh, you know the end results. But yes, uh, if someone want to smoke he would not care about the restrictions or whatever the health ministry has to say but many others feel a smoking ban has huge benefits as far as smoking as the generational bandwagonism is concerned and freedom of expression and such stuff then what about the passive smoker who is also entitled to safe health hmm. as the basic primary individual right and when i'm consciously choosing it According to the World Health Organization by 2010 around 10 lakh people will die of smoking related causes in India most tobacco deaths will occur in rural India the risk of heart disease to passive smokers will increase by 60% for people who are living with a chronic smoker or working in the office and there's more than 6 to 8 hours of contact during the day they are at increased risk of a chronic cough they can get bronchitis or bronchial inflammation and bronchial irritation there is increased risk of chest infections and pneumonia one might say that the only way to prevent people from smoking their lives away is through aggressive awareness while many may argue that this sort of a ban limits their freedom of expression and choice but whatever the argument we cannot afford to lose a generation to smoking with camera person sachin gupta in new delhi nandini sarkar for ndtv